wasn't really happy with my performance. We've actually skated that a lot better. I got the toe steps wrong, which really threw me. I only have to have one little thing that puts me out of my rhythm and I just don't know what to do about it. She didn't skate as well as she could have, and she did stumble on the element. If they'd have gone on Kelly's performance, Kelly should have most probably been doing the skate off. As training begins again, Kelly's under more pressure than ever to blow the judges away. Jane and Chris want us to up the difficulty in our programs, so they really pushed us this week. <laughs> no, we need to keep moving, guys. Right. <laughs> Put the brakes on. For this routine, I think it's all quite scary because <laughs> it means I've got to be slow and all these long lines. I mean, I know what I've got to improve. I mean, I haven't once held my hand up and said I'm a good skater. I know I'm not, and I'm just trying to improve each week. There we go, push up. Yeah. Well, the end of the routine is uh, something completely different. It's a little dangerous, but it's going to be really cool if we can pull it off, which I think we can. <laughs> Skating to Wonderful World, please look over the ice, Todd Sang and Kelly Holmes! I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them blue for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. The colors of the rainbow. In the sky, or also on the faces of people going by, I see friends shaking hands, saying, How do you do? They're really saying, I love you. I hear babies. And I think to myself, what a wonderful Swan lift to finish, and then Kelly Holmes shares a full frontal familiarity with Todd Sand. And was that Kelly's best performance? She's the emerging butterfly of this competition tonight in vibrant blue. Nicely executed compulsory jump. She has twice been first across the gold medal line at 1500 meters and 800 meters as she danced her way further towards the final. These are the marks for Kelly. Four, 3.5, 3.5, four. Four again from Robin. That gives them a total of 19, their best score. Thank you, Tony. 19, please with that. Yeah, very pleased. What's been the public reaction to, to your skating when you've been out on the streets? Everyone's been really... Um, friendly and uh, respects what we're all doing mm. you know we're all here just to try and do our best and uh, me too <laughs> <laughs> looking good tonight Thank and uh, let's see what uh, here we go this is always the bit i dread now <laughs> here we go we might steal ourselves here we go and judges i think you'll be okay kelly i'm going to go straight to karen please I think this week, Kelly's always been about you investing in your own skating. We've seen the benefit of that tonight. You did two of the jumps that were required, and I'm really proud of the way you've, you've tackled it this evening. Well done. Thank you. The audience here agree with you. Judges, thank you very much. Oh, he didn't get a mention. <laughs> he didn't get in this week. <laughs> if, uh, if you don't want Kelly to uh, be on her Todd uh, and out of the competition, then get on the phone and vote for her when the lines open at the end of the show. It's Kelly and Todd.
so it's time to have a quick look at the uh, the leaderboard. We can see that at the moment, Sean and Marika are down the bottom with 18.5. Still very early days yet, though. And at the top, we've Gainer and Daniel. After the break, David and Bonnie will be unleashing their brand new routines. Don't move a muscle.